Yo, what's up? Welcome to the crib. It's that time. It's really time. Yo, what's good? We about to head over to the chapel. <laughs> it's game day, baby! Come on! How are you guys? How are you guys? Yo, what's up, Duke fans? We just got done with our second day of practice. Uh, just got just got done with a cold tub. You see, we got C Reeves in here. We got Jared. We got C Reeves. Spence over there. It was a good day of work, man. We gonna get back at it on Thursday, and uh, we'll keep y'all tuned in. We love to grind. I love to grind. We just getting better, man. It's the first first week of practice. It's the long days in the gym. It's gonna be a great season. It's gonna be a fun season. So we just gonna keep getting better. You know what y'all need after a long day, man? Y'all be talking about, oh, this, that. Nah, y'all just need some rod waving y'all life, man. Thank God I thank you for everything you gave up. The bag secured. Just got back to the crib. It's been a long day. I'm about to just go chill. Watch some TikTok, relax. We got an off day tomorrow, so I'll catch up on some school work. But yeah, I'll catch back up with you guys tomorrow. Hey, this is the spot, Eden's, where me, Jaden, Tyrese, who's not here right now, so we stay. Uh, this is a spot. This is like a legendary Duke spot. Uh, a lot of Duke legends, y'all know, definitely stayed in here. Um, this is our spot now, though. We're sophomores, a little older, so we get to, uh, we get to upgrade a little bit. But uh, we're going to show you around. We come out here, we got the game on, whatever's going on, a fight, uh, just anything. We come in here, we watch it. Moving on to the kitchen. We don't spend a lot of time in here because we at the facility. Um, Jaden actually probably being here the most. He like he like to save money and he like to cook and stuff. And he yeah. got his little stuff. So what? Give him a kitchen tour, Jaden. Hey man, so let's start off with the fridge. Uh, we're a big fans of chicken nuggets. I like my organic chicken nuggets. He be eating weird stuff, bro. Um, weird. We got the air fryer. We cook a lot, you know. The chicken nuggets in. I got my oranges and carrots on the bottom. You know, Mark got his donuts and whatever else he got going Those on. Those donuts been in here since my birthday and it's the end of September. Some protein shakes, gotta get some gains. And then uh, this is really one of the OG things in the house. Probably maybe the most important, what you think? This might be the most. This is probably the most used thing in this Yeah, the air fryer. We cook all the chicken nuggets. Y'all can see, we got Everything in here, we put in an air fryer besides the ice cream. We got the pizzas. We got some organic chicken that Jaden be making. We got the chicken patties. You know what I'm saying? Got the dino nuggets. Y'all see it, man. You just throw it in the air fryer, cook it. It's one of the best inventions ever, for real, man. Because, you know, us, we don't really cook. I'm the, actually, I think I'm the only one who's cooked something in this house. Got some plastic cups. You know, we not washing no dishes in here. So we got the all plastics and stuff like that. I think we got like, yeah, two things of cereal. I don't eat cereal, I'm a little lactose intolerant, so I try to stay away from that. Um, we got the mini hoop. We don't, we don't have a ball for it right now though. Nah. So, if someone wants to donate a ball, that would be nice. We got a little dartboard though. Here we are in the mirror, you know what I'm talking about. Here we go, the dartboard. Jaden's greatest purchase that he's made. The right. only purchase he's actually contributed to the house. That's actually, <laughs> I, I actually, run me my money. I, I paid for all, everything. Still got no money for Steve. He's cut. Dang, that's a nice little shot though. That's almost in the bullseye, too. But yeah, no, that's what I think. Him and Reese be playing this all the time. I don't really uh, get on the darts like that, but I would kill him. I want to be nice. I don't even know if we should show this part of the house. This is Jaden's room. We're gonna have a little sneak peek. It's a little dirty. It's okay. Yeah, it's a little dirty, but uh, you know, <laughs> so we just throw it on top of the drawers. Gotta have the water. Um, again, this is all my clothes. Uh, got the Netflix on, got the PlayStation. Yeah, just gotta stay right, so. Dang, that's a mess in here. That's a mess in here. You ain't even gotta look at my room. Y'all can have a little, a little sneak peek, a little quick peek. Ooh, ah. Uh, that's how y'all get into my room. Yo, what's up? It's Mark. Just woke up. About to head over to breakfast, uh, head to class. Uh, we have an off day today, so just chilling, getting some treatment in, gonna recover. Good angle of Mark trying to drive. 
his new whip on East Campus. Try not to run this person over. He was walking in the middle of the road. How are you, Mark? I'm good. How are you guys? How are you guys? Where are you going, Mark? Shoot, we just left class, you know, had to... What'd you learn? What'd you learn? Uh, I just learned about the Duke history of Duke basketball. Oh. Talked a little bit about uh, C.B. Claiborne. Y'all probably don't know about C.B. Claiborne, but y'all should, though, but it's all right. It's um, a good one in there. Yeah, we're just heading to class now for another two and a half hours, and yeah, go get some treatment after and have a photo shoot later, so. Um, I remember yesterday, I was giving y'all the room tour, and I didn't want to show my room, and that's because it was a little dirty. But we're going to clean it today. It shouldn't take too long. It's just, you know the week gets hectic. You're going from practice, school, all that. Like Sometimes you're just in a hurry. But we're going to clean it up. I'm going to show y'all. It's not even It's not even that bad. I got my backpack. I was. I just took a nap, so I got a snack. I got everything in here, man. But we're going to clean it real quick. And shoot, I'm going to show y'all. Alright, and I'm back. It only took like 15 minutes, maybe not even. I've had clothes everywhere and stuff like that, but as y'all can see, it looks a little better. Hey, don't judge my bed making skills. I don't make my bed like that, but I was like today, just to make it look a little neater, I'd make my bed, but. This is a rock, a rock I got from Bible study. Have love, be patient, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know I keep the Bible on me. Hallelujah. I definitely have a lot more shoes. I still got some of the same ones, but definitely have a lot more. So I was like, I should give the people like a little update of what I got, so. Got these black fours. I probably wear these the most out of any shoe right now. You can kind of wear them with anything. So I just, I wear them all the time. I've worn these in photo shoots. I'm probably about to put them down right now. I got these other fours right here. So another shoe I've worn a lot. They're a little beat now, like another shoe. A lot of a lot of wear and tear on these joints, but that's why these shoes are on the floor because like they've they went through the ringer. Y'all can see these. Shoot, I wear these anywhere. These customized joints right here. That's not. I know y'all don't like the other color on those, but it's a nice little shoe. Some of my favorite gets. These Romeros. These Romeros is kind of fire. Oh. These fours right here. I love them too. I love these shoes. I've worn them a lot. I was selling my other Romeros so much. I had to get another pair. I had to get them in blue though. So, I mean, <laughs> all my clothes are like blue. So, oh, these Waffle Sakai's. These are chill little joint. I was like, dang, that's kind of tough. So, I got me a pair. The cool gray 11s. Another shoe. I only wear on special occasions. I definitely had these last year too, but. Another staple you gotta have is the Uggs. The Uggs is. But when it gets cold outside, every road trip, every little picture thing y'all see me, I promise you, I'm probably gonna have the Uggs on. Just, do you know who put me on? D-Live last year. He's always had the Uggs on every day. Him and Flip, I'll be like, dang. That's probably that Northeast stuff though. They from the cold, they probably put on before me. So, cut, 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 cut. Gotta go get some more shoes, hold on. The little Duke joints. These Travis Scott Air Maxes. I got these a few weeks ago. I actually wore them to the Drake concert. I love them. And the shoe people actually made fun of me for when I first got them, but shoot, these are one of my favorite shoes actually. I wear them a lot. Actually last year, Jake started wearing them. And I was like, dang, those kind of hard, but I always thought they was like old man shoes, but I trust me, get you a pair. They comfortable and they like $75. So you ain't gotta break the bank. Like some of these other shoes, $300, $400. Nah, these is 75 bucks. Nike.com, get you a pair. That's all the shoes I have in here. Obviously, I have a lot in my, at the gym, in my car. But in here, that's all I got. But that's definitely a little upgrade from last year. Last year, I had like a couple pair of shoes. But you know, as you get older, you start to elevate in life. Shoot, your shoe collection starts to elevate. It's not that I didn't like shoes. I just, you know, couldn't afford them. But NIL, baby. I'm about to head over to the video shoot. About to, I don't even know what I'm going to wear. But I'm going to figure out something. I'm going to get ready. Uh, I'll give you the final look. Um, it's for the video shoot. I'm sure y'all gonna see it in a few weeks. It'll come out and uh, I got some walking shots though. So it's nice in the jersey. Um, so I gotta put a little something on. I'll show y'all when I'm done. Uh, look at the fit for the shoot. Um, 
I put on a little Duke varsity jacket, some black cargos, Timber symbol. I told y'all I wear them, I didn't wear these fours a lot. Put them on again, cause they, again, they go everything. So, but y'all can see it, show a little fit. We all wearing the same thing pretty much, but yeah. Yo, what's good? We about to head over to the chapel. <laughs> Uh, he's trying to laugh at me because I'm trying to get good content though. <laughs> he think he could be better with a camera when he really couldn't. He's trying to laugh at me the whole time. He wouldn't do He wouldn't do Yo, what's up? We're going to the chapel. My name is Bart Mitchell. <laughs> now nah, we about to head over to the chapel uh, for this video shoot. Gonna get some, some good film. First of all, I just wanted for my he's, photo shoot. These are mine. These are mine. I just wanted for my photo shoot. We know who the court. The, the Kyle likes to lie about his shoe game, Thank but y'all don't know. Hey, about that. Whoa, it, Mark. <laughs> appreciate it, Mark. These are mine. These are mine. Why are you talking crazy about your my shoes? shoes. My shoes. That's your crazy. shoes. All right, now we now we trying to scuff them and stuff. You see who the real kicks champion is, though. That Look. is true. He do got some heat on his feet right now. <laughs> And that's we got Flip over here. He got the ones on. That's oh not even bad feet. That's, 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 that's not bad feet. You just look like a little piece. dad right now, for real. I'm not looking like a dad. This is my pregame. I'm looking like a dad, bro. See, Reeves actually <laughs> might have the most basketball shoes on the team, besides Jeremy. It's because he's been buying them since he's But he, he wears like he's two been pairs. 17 since third grade. That is true. Yeah. Even though he wears two pairs of shoes. That's a fact. But it's all right. It's another good day. Got that hot shoot right now. It's a little foggy. I'm not going to lie. But it's cool. It's something different. I think it's gonna be good. Yeah, you see what I got on. Oh, a little chill. Oh, that's okay, chill. Mark. chill. It's calm. Okay, Mark. You know, you know. Man, that was really cool. That was really cool. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Good God. <laughs> He be trying to make fun of me for being on a vlog. Like, he wouldn't do no better. Like, I don't know what he thinks this is. Got a little switcheroo. Got the jersey back on. 2-5. Feels good to have the jersey back on. Just got done with the walk and shoot. About to get in the smoke under the arches, but stay tuned. I wear 25 because Jordan was 23, Kobe was 24. Like when I was younger, like no one's been 25. So I was like, shoot, I gotta be 25. Now. I'm here with the Young Bulls. What's good, Duke? Sean right here. Mm -hmm. CJ, say what's up to the camera, bro. What's up, Duke? Yo. <laughs> say what's up to the camera. Yo, what's up, Duke Blue Planet? <laughs> and y'all's favorite person in the world. <laughs> what's good, Duke? You know what I'm saying? And if y'all really know me, y'all know I love breakfast food. So I'm at none other than one of the greatest spots on earth. I love it. It might be the best breakfast place in the world. The OG spot, Waffle House. I'm about to go in here, get some food. Just got my waffles. Y'all can see it. It's beautiful. Every time, it's beautiful. Look at it. Every time. It looks good every single time, bro. You see it. Thank you. Here's a before. Look at the egg. The egg is beautiful every time to the sausage. I don't think I asked for toast, but it's all good. But I'm about to dig in. I'm about to get right. It was a good meal, a great meal. Um, I couldn't even finish it all, though. I usually do, but tonight, I guess I just wasn't feeling it. But that's it. I'm about to head home. It's probably like 10.30 now, but I've just been sitting here watching TikTok while I was eating. So, yeah, about to get out of here and uh, get ready for mom. Yo, ever since this like Travis Kelsey stuff came out about like him dating Taylor Swift, I was like, dang, people talking about, oh, she put him on a map. I was like, yo, that's crazy. But I was like, dang, like Taylor Swift really is like super famous. Like I was going through my joint. I was like, do I have Taylor Swift songs on my phone? Let alone I did. Cause I listen to all music. If y'all didn't know, I listen to everything. She's one of them ones for sure. But this joint is crazy right here. This joint right here is crazy. He said, Our song is just game with same door, sleeping alley, tapping on your window. When we're on the phone and you talk real slow. Y'all get the gist, man. Asking God if he can play it again. If you can see the who understands you. Bro, I'm not a Swifty, but she be going stupid, I ain't gonna lie. She be going dumb. Bro, 
I might be able to sing for real. A hotel. Damn. My mom called me. Uh, yo, what's up? I'm just in academic hours. About to get some work done. Talking about climate change. Um, get all my work for the following week. That's why I moved it to Friday. So it's like, you get the work done for the next week. Now, I always get it done. I'm always gonna get it finished. It might be a weird way, unique way. I'm, I'm always gonna get it done now. So just gotta get my work done before this big weekend. Shout out Duke football. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a movie. Hey, fun fact of the day. Project Up, did you guys know that the US military is one of the biggest polluters in the world? Which is kind of wild, like, more than most countries, the US military, I gotta write my paper on it. So yeah. What's up? Saturday, one of the biggest days in Duke history, for real. We're about to head over to game day. I'm with Jay and Reese. It should be a good day, man. We head over to game day. We're about to go check it out. Yo, we really out at game day right now, man. This is crazy, though. And they really got Pat McAfee in this joint. He's one of them ones. I've been watching Pat McAfee show for years. Yeah, I can I can barely see it myself. I can barely see. Uh, you know, it's an experience. It's obviously, uh, you know, a great thing for the school that we got college game day here. Uh, I can feel the energy. There's a lot of people around, so uh, I'm hoping for a great game tonight. For sure, man. It's a legendary Duke day, man. It's legendary. Y'all see all the people out here, man. We pulled up for a little bit, see what the function was about. Love seeing all the Duke supporters, the Duke family out there, man. But we better stop by Pitchforks. One of the OG spots. You went to Duke in the last couple of years. I don't know how long it's been here, but better stop. Get some food real quick. I think we really got the best fans in the world. I think just being at college game day for an hour, I could see that. Um, all the pictures I took, all the people, all the support, I felt it, I felt the love. Um, one thing about Duke fans, man, they're going to support you. They're going to love you. And they're not just basketball fans. They're everything fans, just supporting the school. Wanting to see the school do good, man, just like I do. But just stick with us. It's going to be a special year. Keep supporting us. Stay with us. And it's going to be a great year. So we sitting here watching this Colorado game, man. Me, Jay Shoot. I'm a Colorado fan. How can you not be a Colorado fan? It's the prime era, baby. I'm a Colorado fan. Y'all call me a bandwagon, whatever. I rock with Colorado, I rock with Duke. Yeah, this is what we do every Saturday. We sit on the couch, <laughs> watch a couple hours of football. Usually the team's over, but it's a hectic day, so everybody's just trying to chill before the night, before the big game, but that's what we do. It's game day, baby! Come on! It's time! What can y'all say? It's our moment! It's Duke's moment. It's that day. It's that time. We turn. We live. Duke, baby. Duke versus the world, man. Come on. Let's do it. Let's go. What's good? We really out here. Y'all see it, man. It's a great day. It's a beautiful day. It's a lit day. Usually they do this when we play, but we not around. So this is crazy just getting to see this experience. But y'all can see it. This is actually crazy. Usually when it's going on, we playing, man. But shout out Duke football. It's a great day. We lit. Let's go. In Kville, as a walkthrough for a second, I got Stan in the background. Say what's up, Stan. Hey. Kville's popping. About to stop by the gym for a second before we walk on this field. I don't know how many times I gotta say this. This is a great day in Duke history, man. I'm glad I get to experience it. Right, hey guys, so we're gonna be here. Uh, what's your prediction for the game, Jaden? I said 27-21. Uh, oh, yep, no, what's your prediction, Mark? Bro, stop playing. <laughs> All right, here we right. go. What's up? What's your prediction? <laughs> Christian oh. always late. Oh. Always late. See, Reeves always late, always man. He ain't late. even need the crib. Yeah, put him on. Oh, hell what no, look at him. What you gotta look say? Look at him, look at him, look at him. It's gonna be a battle in the trenches. <laughs> Come to Duke football, baby. Duke football, where it's at, baby. It's the Elko era, dog. I don't think that was a part Stop playing with us. I ain't gonna lie, this will look like a little long walk. I am not gonna catch it. If you fall, I can imagine. Are you running out this joint? The adrenaline rush will be crazy. I can feel the energy already. It's different. Clemson was different, but this is like really different. It's prime time. Shout 
about the live though. It's a movie! Yeah. I ain't never seen it look like this ever. This is crazy. Uh, hey Duke fans, hey Mark. Um, what is your food of choice at a football game? You know, I'm always gonna get a glizzy. I gotta get two glizzies, it's a custom, I have to. I'm not even playing. This got me hype, but I'm not playing. I'm ready to run to a wall right now. So I went to go get a hot dog, and then I'm coming back. I'm trying to find some condiments. There's no ketchup on this side of the stadium. So I'm about to just eat my glizzy with no ketchup, which is crazy. I don't know if I've ever done this. A glizzy with no ketchup, but I'm out here and I'm hungry, so I don't got a choice. 13-7, we just scored a touchdown. 3.36 left in the third quarter. We just need to stop right here, and we're right in this game. fun day. One of my funnest days I've had at Duke. Um, I'm glad I got to experience it and everything that came with it. Obviously, it didn't um, in the way we wanted to, but that's just life, I guess. And um, Hopefully, we get to experience it again one day. And um, I feel like now we just got to win a natty to make up for the feelings that were felt last night with, within each other, within this, the students. It was... Um, it was a sad night, but it was a good day. It was a good weekend, and yeah.